JVL Integrated Servo Motors consists of a motor and a plug-in communication module. The control power and motor power are separated so the motor can be turned off while still being able to monitor its position and status. Motor power and control power on Mac 402 has two different power connectors, a connector on the motor and a connector on the communication module. Mac 402 has dual DC voltage. Uh, the motor runs 12 to 48 volts and the control 12 to 24 volts. The motor connector has six pins. All six are used to distribute the high current to the terminals. The Mac 402 cable is available in two versions. The color codes are different, but both cables share that one to three are connected to power plus and four to six to ground. The green yellow wire to earth. Also connect the screen to ground. The M12 five pin control power connector is unified on all JVL motors and M12 power cables. The wires also share the same color coding. Connect both brown and white to 24 volt DC control power plus. Connect both the blue and gray to ground. Connect the black wire to 24 volt DC control voltage. Note that the black wire on specific modules is supply voltage for IOs or unused. Confirm power is off before connecting the power connector. Insert the connector straight and tighten thoroughly. Connect the control power cable. Now switch on your power supply. Depending on the module you're using, you'll see the LED turn on. If the module you're using does not have an LED, a cable with an LED inside the connector is available. For commissioning and programming, use JVL's MacTalk software or a supported PLC. With MacTalk, you can do fast test movements and use the scope function to perform diagnostics and optimization. Be aware of voltage drops during acceleration, especially when several motors share a power supply. Make sure you have enough total power to run all motors at the same time, or sequence the accelerations, or reduce the maximum peak to stay below the available power limit. The default is 300%. Also note, you must stay below an average of 100% or you could get an accumulated overload. This was a quick power connection guide. For in-depth information, please read the manual. To learn more about JVL Intelligent Motors or to learn how to program with the MacTalk software, I recommend watching some of the many JVL webinars. If you found the video useful, please like and subscribe. Your comments are also very welcome. Thank you.